Hi, Space 1889 fans. This is Daryl Hayhurst, the designer of the latest edition of Space 1889. Let's talk a little bit about villains. Bring on the bad guys, right? Because one of the questions that we would get asked is like, what's the story? What's the setup? What are we doing? And who is up against us, right? And so the heroes of this story are explorers. Rather than being from a specific nation, they are from multiple nations or multiple worlds. So we're very broad about the kind of heroes that you can play. And that means we have to be a little choosy about well, who are the villains for something like this, because we absolutely allow you to you know, be from a nation and bring that baggage with you, right? Like, oh, I want, I've got it out for these guys. Uh, and that can vary wildly from group to group. But there are certain ones that kind of everybody's going to be up against. One is a classic from the original, the cult of the worm, right? Inside Mars, there is a consciousness and it is projecting a malevolent and nihilistic form, you know, philosophy through its worshipers. And they want to, the planet to die. Like it is already dying. They want to make that happen faster. And they're, they don't want just Mars, right? So that's a pretty easy one. Like nobody really wants to die. So uh, Cult of the Worm are going to be villains overall. Um, then there's the anarchists. And the anarchists just want to bring everything down. And honestly, the heroes might even agree with them on certain levels. But the anarchists, there's no real organization. And a lot of them are targeting ether flyers. And as an ether flyer crew, that puts a bullseye on you. So even if you agree with them, you got to worry about, you know, that they're not going to be friends, right? And then the new other new one is the masters of energy. And they are like the opposite of the anarchists. They want to fix the world. You know, they want to control it. They want to make it more efficient. And they are all brilliant scientists and, you know, taking all of the the incredible inventions that exist in the thing that one step too far to make them this malevolent controlling force that needs to be stopped and then of course in the background there's always been hints and whispers of an ancient race the phaetons you know the, their planet was that you know was one once once a planet now the asteroid field and there have been signs of their civilization everywhere out in those asteroids or ancient technology that you can take and adapt. And we're trying to say they're coming back, right? They're a force that's out there and they've already started moving. And that will be something that everyone's going to need to get together to deal with by the, the end of the tale. So that's just a taste of some of the, the bad guys, you know, that we're going to bring on for you guys to face.